What is going on ladies and gentlemen, my name is Ecoli Espresso and welcome back to another Black Ops 3 video here today on the channel. This one, we haven't done anything like this in quite some time, but I've been playing around with it a lot here within Black Ops 3 and I figured, you know what, let's do another class setup of the class that I'm using the absolute most at this very point in time within the game's lifespan. Now, as you guys know, there's a lot of different combinations for every single gun that you can use and a lot of them, a lot of people will say is overpowered or whatever, but this one literally, I think, is the definition of overpowered overpowered. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Vesper, a weapon that a lot of people will already say is overpowered, but this class, really, it is absolutely insane. This is my free for all class, this is what I use for every single free for all match, and I'll tell you right now, it works. I only have two losses in all of Black Ops 3 for free for all, both of which were rage quits, which I literally rage quit because the person was sitting in a corner or something like that, but this thing carries me to victory all the time, and I really wanted to just share it with you guys. Now, the class setup, just jumping right into it, obviously is the Vesper. We're not going to run any optics on it here, but we are going to use some primary gunfighter slots. We're going to run four attachments here, that being Quick Draw, Grip, Stock, as well as the much needed Extended Mags. This combination of attachments will allow you to get your weapon up quick, allow you to have less recoil because the Vesper does at times have pretty crazy recoil. Stock will allow you to aim down sight while moving, which is very crucial for how you want to play some of these tight situations. Whether you're holding down a room or holding down an entire area of the map, it is really helpful. And then of course, extended mags, because the Vesper's fire rate is so high, it burns through ammo. And especially once you get that extended mags, it adds a little bit into the ammo reserve here and how many shots you have overall. And that just helps out tremendously, as well as you don't burn through ammo as quickly. So that's gonna do it for the weapon itself. Now, the next biggest part of this class setup is the perks. This is honestly probably the more crucial part out of all of this. And that is going to include Sixth Sense, Tracker, and Awareness. These are literally all the best perks, I think, here in terms of free-for-all gameplay styles. A lot of the times, stuff will come in handy in other game modes like Domination, Hardpoint, or something like that. Like, Flak Jacket is definitely a necessity for Hardpoint, and maybe even Domination if you want to go that far. But these three perks are literally the perfect setup, I think, for free-for-all. You can maybe throw in Dead Silence in there if you want to sacrifice, say, an attachment, or just want to sacrifice sacrifice awareness, but if you have a headset and you run these perks, you literally will not lose a free-for-all, I feel. Sixth Sense allows you to see it when an enemy is right on top of you almost, which doesn't actually seem as useful as it is, but it truly is a very helpful perk, especially because it uses it through walls even. So if somebody's outside of you, chances are with awareness, you'll be able to hear them firstly, but if you don't, you'll be able to see that they're on the other side of a wall from you and you can go in there expecting a gunfight, whereas your enemy may not. Tracker does help a lot. Sometimes you'll be able to see enemy footprints here and be able to track them down and get a free kill from behind while you're doing this. And awareness is obviously, I think, one of the most important perks here with this, especially if you play with a headset, because having used awareness in other Call of Duties, I feel like this one jacks up the footstep volume tremendously higher than in previous Call of Duties. And if you do have that headset and that map awareness, you'll be able to pick off people left, right, and center. So that is gonna do it for this one here. That is the conclusion of this class setup. That's what we all covered here. And really, I want you to give this one a try. Let me know your thoughts on it if you do in fact do. This class setup, once again, it has been extremely successful for me. It's been probably my favorite class setup for a long time now in Call of Duty Black Ops 3. So I want to share it with you guys. I want to bring you guys this little bit of what I play with and I hopefully can help you guys do a little bit better with your gameplay. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys did like the video at any point in time during this, be sure to leave a like rating down below. It really does help the video as well as the channel out. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. My name is Nicolai Espresso. I will see you guys later. Take care and peace.